Hey everybody, this is Aaron. I'm giving an update on the Reliable Electric Pure Sine Wave Inverter, 3000 watt, 12 volt. I came down here to check the system this morning, or this afternoon, and the first thing I noticed was, right now my I got my transfer switch unhooked, but my transfer switch was pulling off of the house, off the grid. I wasn't for sure what was going on. So I unhooked the transfer switch, hooked it back up, and it transferred back to the battery. But when I did that, uh, my uh, inverter wasn't powering up the house. Uh, it was telling me it had 12.2 volts, which even right now we're still at 11.9. I mean, it's still not out of range for this inverter or my transfer switch but the inverter was telling me it's 12.2 volts but my display right there the bottom one or the top one this one right here uh, was not telling me what voltage <clears throat> um, so I unhooked the transfer switch left everything powered up thinking uh, just low vat voltage or something um, I had some friends over so we went upstairs we were watching some uh, TV and BS and all that and when we came back down we heard a high pitch uh, high pitch alarm basically so when I came down here both the green and the red light were on I was still not getting any voltage out of it um, so I quickly flipped the switch off and then I went to flip it back on when I did that Right through here in this vent. I saw a nice little arc flash along with up top uh, So my inverter is in fact Right now dead. I actually unhooked it from the battery for safety reasons but I am no longer running off grid with my power um, I am actually back on my grid and I'm going to be contacting Amazon about my inverter because this has only been in for about a month and a half at most two months and I don't think it should have just popped like that um, I know someone's probably going to ask me well, how much am I drawing well our normal usage on it is roughly about 800 watts is what we're drawing off of it and that's just basically for a few lights um, even tonight we didn't weren't pulling off of it we do see upwards of maybe 12 uh, when we run the washing machine which is powered by this so I'm not hitting the 3000 that it's rated for I know I'm not Every time I've tested it, it's always been um, under a thousand watts. Um, with the washing machine just running itself, that'll draw five amp, which is roughly, you know, 600, amp, 600 watts, 700 watts. So we are, you know, not anywhere near abusing this inverter. Um, I don't know if it just happened to be a bad board or what, but I will be contacting Amazon and I will be talking to Reliable. Um, I hope someone can possibly give me an idea of maybe what I did wrong, but I'm pretty sure there was nothing I did wrong with it. I mean, it is just an inverter. You plug it in and go. Um, thanks for watching. I hope someone uh, can possibly see, tell me something.